Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and Noob Gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Mennings. And in today's episode, I'm going to be going back to my roots, back to the thing that got me into uh, Star Citizen, which is box missions. I'm going to start building up my rep and see how good I get and uh, see if we can get to them bunkers missions. So we hope you like this video, guys, from the intro. bit of housework to get through here guys uh, the code dropping down is a code we picked at random from our comment section if you want your code to show in the next video if you've subscribed to the channel just leave a comment with your code and we'll pick them at random like we always do and um, if you're new to star citizen use that code as a referral in your creating your star citizen account at rsi and um, you'll get 5,000 credits and push that person up in the rankings the names coming across the bottom we want to give uh, a massive massive thank you to every one of you guys including leo with his one year membership uh, so they joined on youtube and they pay a small fee uh, monthly and they get videos early and some badges and stuff like that and so if you're interested in that guys just hit that join button it really does uh, help us out moving forward and to make this a, a full-time thing for, for, for us and if you also check out the description we've got the discord link in there some great people especially with 3.23 coming out there's going to be a lot of people that's going to need teams so jump on that discord we've got about 250 people on there so it, it's good it's good for people that want to jump on and see other people and, and get on games with other people a really good community i love every everyone on there and uh, the org as well if you want to join the org it's new gaming over on the rsi site and so that's it let's get into this one guys so today i did a um, small mission the other day how to do cargo running with a small ship and one of the things i did was picking up a box what they call box mission uh, little box mission things and that is the first thing that i ever saw on star citizen i saw ollie uh, doing a box mission and it just made me fall in love with the game um, uh, Akil Thani sent the video to me and it just made me fall in love with the game I absolutely loved it and I, when we first started doing these box missions me and Akil Thani, the game it was in 317 and the game used to crash a lot and we'd lose the mission so we ended up giving up and not doing them and then we got into the cargo running and doing other things like that and then um, everything's just gone on from there so uh, today what I'm doing is I'm back on the box missions because I really fell in love with that and it, it, it really um, got me going again when I did one the other day. So I'm going to build up my reputation. I'm going to do one of the big ones, the five box missions here, the five the five pickups and the five drop-offs. I'll probably only do that, grab the gear, uh, the looting and stuff like that. Maybe grab a little bit of cargo on the way and then sell that and see what we get at the end. And um, what I'm going to do then is as my rep builds, I'm going to probably do more of this stuff on the live feeds. And so you guys can join in with me as I'm doing these and, and watch me doing them and, and having the chats and stuff like that while I build my rep. So we get to the bunker ones where we can do the box missions in the bunkers and be earning around 40, 50 grand per run. Um, yeah, so we hope you like this one, guys, and let's get into it. So I'm going to pick up this mission here. I'm going to try and build up my rep so I can get some other missions. But I'm going to pick up this one here, which is picking up five boxes. And we're going to get 15 grand from this, as well as some good rep. And then we'll do the loot as well. Uh, so I'm just looking at where I need to go first. See this one, this one. So I'm looking at this one here, and we've got Caltech here, and we're going to drop off at Caltech, uh, pick up at Caltech here. So we might as well get 773 first from Deltana, come to Caltech, drop it off, pick up Geltech's one, drop it off. Um, uh, Caltech's one, uh, sorry, go to, De go to Deltana, which then goes to Caltech to drop off, and then we'll pick one up at the Caltech. And then we're, all the others then are just themselves, basically. So we're going to take that one. So it's going to be a bit of a few box missions and just grabbing. Let's let all these come in. There we are. So we've got five. So we're going to go to... The first one we're going to go to is... Deltana. And then we'll go to Celtic from there.
let's do this. I'm just setting myself up one sec. I've put my Morbi glass on as well today. Not my Morbi glass, my um, Torbi glass thing. So let's reset that. Alright, so I've put that on today. Let's do it. Box missions, ahoy! So this is what got me into Star Citizen, watching people do box missions like this. Where are we at? I haven't even picked it up, have I? So I'm going to pick up the... Because we're going to have five packages, I'm going to end up picking up the... Um, the 35C. I want a fast ship, a small fast ship I want. So I'm going to pick up the 35C. That one. Vehicle select. Your vehicle has been delivered. Hangar 4. I only see three box missions here. So hopefully it hasn't bugged down. Love this ship. Lovely little ship, this one. Someone said in one of our comments, people get caught up with the bigger ships a lot and they sort of just miss what the smaller ships can do. And this is a great ship. It refuels itself with this system here, this uh, adaptive intake refinery thing. So it ends up refueling itself. Turn ship on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems operational. Turn ship on. Starting pre-flight protocols. Yeah. All systems operational. Request takeoff. Requesting clearance. Power shields. Maximizing shields. Okay, so let's do this then. Let's grab and go to the first one that we need to go to. Which is down here, I think it's this one here, Deltana, yeah. It's where we want to go, to Deltana. Because then when we go to Keltag, we can drop off Keltags at the same time. We track landing gear. Such a beautiful ship. So sleek. Quantum drive activated. So let's do this, guys. Landing gear.
Crest London. They're not even loaded in yet, the places, have they? Now we're getting there. So, where's the box? Zoom in here. We'll just land in here because we've got a loop. Let's land. Open doors. Really, I should have turned my engines off. Yep, I better do that actually. Because we're up and floating in the air again. Landing complete. <laughs> I don't think it is. Oh, it is. I'm turning the engines off anyway, just in case. Because then it does my shields as well. Turn engines off. Powering down so what I'll do is, I'm going to... To my thing, okay, fair enough. Right, we've landed. So, it's first box, let's do this. And then we'll take this to Keltag and pick up a Keltag as well. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this door here as well. So, I can put boxes in there if I need to. Let's loot and grab the boxes. It's, so, it's something I don't really see a lot of people doing much of is the box rep stuff because you can earn some really good money towards the end of it you start getting some really good contracts like 40 grand contracts so let's take all this stuff because we need we'll, take the, we, we'll get the money for it so let's take it and I'll always take some food as well Food and water, could take that. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna start collecting this ratter dung. Because you can get it's you can get some good money from that if you sell it. So what I'm gonna do is to start collecting it. And maybe in like a couple of months time I'll have enough to, to have some good money from it. So there's the package I see it now. Over in that one. So let's clear the areas first. Remember to put it into your ship as well, guys, as you won't be able to sell it. Okay. Another red box. I must have run past that. There's another package there. Definitely not my package, though. I want to take somebody else's package. 
We're in there again. Real scarcity of red boxes. Or even boxes in general. When I first started playing this game, there used to be loads of boxes. And in the or in the white boxes, you used to find the white med guns. And they used to sell for 700 a pop. And you'd get, you'd get so many of them, you'd make so much money selling them at 700 a pop. There's no boxes first. Hi. Hey. Oh, no boxes. Let's grab the package. Come on. Come on. Do it. I drop it or something. It does feel like this server's a bit laggy. Now we've got it. Now we've got it, guys. Celtic. Oh, I forgot to do exactly what I said. Don't forget to do, and I went and forgot and did it. Move your gear over. <laughs> Vehicles. If you get it where it's greyed out, you have to move one first and then you can move it on. There we are. Okay, let's do this to the next next one, Keltag. Turn engines on. Starting All systems operational. Close doors. Thrusters. I see my power triangle. Let's have a look what we've got cash wise. We got five, seven, seven, four, ten. We just make a note of that. And then I know later on what we've made what we've made.
Let's drop off and pick up at the same place. Open doors. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Engines inactive. All right. Drop off the first one. Pick up the second one. Big thumbs up. So let's start looting. What can we loot from the place? What can we loot? What can we loot? From there. From underneath. It's got a barrel here. Come on, Dom. So another thing you could do is you could look at the places you go in and see if you could get some commodities to take over to them. How's it going? I'll take the rattle dung again. I'll take the boots. I'll take the tractor beam. I'll take the rattle dung. Still had one on over there. So these grey boxes they used to always have one or two white um, things in. The, uh, not these ones, but the, the medical ones. They used to always have one or two of them in them. We used to always earn so much money from them. somebody else's packages here.
No, I didn't see the package in here when I came in earlier. Must have run right past it. Sure, I've got it this time. Right, on to the next place. So, let's look at where we're going now to drop this off, or if we need to drop it off first. Uh, contracts manager. So we've got a pick up from SMO8, Newquist, Newquist. So we're gonna click two from Newquist, so that's good. Um, yeah. We're going to click two from New Quest. We're going to drop this one off at McGrath, which is on it's Cleo, Magda Kalipe. Mining FM6 on Kalope. So we could do both the Kalope ones, the three Kalope ones. Magritic, so 6-4 is going to Clope, and 1-5 is going to Clope, and 2-3 is going to Clope. So with 2-3 we've got, so we've got 4-5, uh, no 6-4 and on Magritic, and 1-5 on Magritic. So we'll get them to next, Newquist Emergency Sensor, and then because they're going to Clopey anyway, Kalipe or whatever. We might as well collect them and be getting them all at the same place. Let's do it. Alright, so where do we want? New quest. Emergency shelter. There. Turn engines on. Starting Close doors. We track landing gear. See, when you have it in target mode, what I had a minute ago, where your crosshair is moving, you, I think you can move your gimbaled guns with your head. Right, let's do it. Grab the two packages here, and then head off to Kalipa.
Ignition drive deactivated. Why on again? Open doors. Turn engines off. Towering down systems. Inactive. So there won't be a lot to loot here. Oh, and I forgot to take all that loot from the other place, didn't I? Again. So there won't be a lot to loot here, do it then. Let's drop that one there. So we don't have to double sidecom. Ship and go. Turn engines on. Turn engines on. Starting green. Close doors. All systems We're going to go to Kalipi now. I'm going to drop off here now. And because we're in the same area, we might as well drop off at the same places. Not places, but by going to the moon itself. So that way. We'll just have to look at when we get up there. Jump round.
I started Star Citizen, this was impo it was sort of impossible to do missions like this because there were so many crashes. It would constantly be crashing and you would lose the mission. But it's now more solid. And beginner players, this is it's it's fun gameplay. Uh, this it's just it's just real fun gameplay. So SML eight, so and Vec, we'll go there first. Does that because I don't retract it and I end up quantum it out and then it shuts it itself and I've already given the order to to, to open it. Oh, there it is. Be careful with moons because you will go crashing into the surface. So they come in now, we scan how many buildings there is, so I know how many to loot. Right, so look, where are we dropping this? Over there. Oh. Careful, turn it. Open doors. Open doors. Turn engines off. Make sure we take the right package. Which is six four. This one here. For the vehicle terminal. No. Dropping a box off, you just saw me do it. So that's that done. Do some looting. This time though, let's remember to put it over to to um I wonder if I can just wear that. No, too big. Remember to put it on the ship this time, guys. Remind me. Put it on my ship. Give me a shout out to remind me, put it on my ship, guys. Let's have a look at what they've got to sell here. Agriculture and medical supplies. Go pick up a few of those and drop them off to one of the other places we're going to. But I think we're going to a place where they sell gold, so I might pick up gold when we do. So that's one place done. I wouldn't advise on leaving your doors open like that. But me, I live dangerous. It's my middle name, Noobs Dangerous Gaming. Okay. 
and Kilthanis is his noobs, noob, noobis, and noobus gaming. The mightiest of noobs. Yep. That's two done, one down, uh, one to go, sorry. Take that seven ratadung. I'm gonna end up with so much ratadung in a couple of months that I'm gonna sell it for millions. Boxes are so infrequent now than what they used to be. Right, so that's all the looting done here. Remind me, guys, I've got to put it on my ship. Basement. Let's not forget this time. Let's move it all over. Turn ship on. Starting pre-flight protocols. Pause doors. All systems operational. Turn engines on. So we only have to go up about a thousand or something like that and down to the next one. So we'll drop off at six. Um no we'll drop off at Yeah we'll go to six and then eight. So I think eight one of these one of these two has gold. So let's do it. Said these one of these has gold. I'm not too sure actually. I've got it in my head they do, but they might not do. No matter if they don't. Quantum 
Sounds like an alien ship, this thing. Open doors. Open doors. Turn engines off. Alright, so which one are we moving this time? 15. So it's not that one. It's that one. What I'm going to do is still going to grab this one and get it out there, out of this area, just in case I do pick up any cargo. I don't want to end up losing the cargo space because I've got that in the way. Grab that one. Take a drink. Ah, uh, someone had one of those missions where you get them all from this thing here and then it's messed up. Hiya. Hello. Hello. Welcome. Start moving some stuff over. Must remember to get a drink. Let's do it here while I can. It's about Got to do some looting. One of the things I loved about Star Citizen, I was watching, I think it was Ollie. That was one of my first videos I watched Ollie doing a box mission. And I was just like, oh my God, I want to do, I want to play this game. I didn't check that I want this old here. I need to save this old gold. I'll check when I go back up in a minute. See, these are not worth anything. Only the yellow ones are worth something. They're only worth one, I think. Check the rat's a dung again. Nice and chilled. I 
pressurizing. Open for me. Grand's worth of stuff there. Really sparse, isn't it? Didn't see that when I came in. Go and see what they sell. Yeah. Where's my package being taken away? That's why you don't leave your things open, guys. Someone's took the package. Hello. Now he's dropped it. So what do they sell here? Astatine, chlorine, fluorine, hydrogen. So it's not, they don't sell gold here. Oh yeah. <laughs> Guys, that's why you don't leave packages lying around or your ship <laughs> unattended. <laughs> Taking my package. Drop it. Drop it. Where's the package? On the bed. Thank you. Right, so that's that one done. Three or five done. We've got one of the other packages, so we've just got to deliver this one and, and pick up and deliver another one. Turn chip on. He turned my ship off, didn't he? Mm -hmm. I wonder if he tried nicking it.
Okay, so what we're going to do here, we have to pick up a package here, so let's do that. There it is. So we'll get down to this one, pick up this second package, and then we can go and deliver the last two. Retract landing gear. Retract landing gear. Retracting landing gear. Deploy landing gear. Deploying landing gear. Landing gear deployed. The upside down ship there. I see that a lot. Open doors. Turn engines off. Again, I forgot to take all the stuff that I've looted as well, didn't I? Second one I've done it at. Thing is, I'm not too bothered because that stuff will, when they when they put a new patch out, that stuff gets brought over to my my main built my main place, so I'm not too bothered.
bit of loot in. Before I grab the box. I'm not too sure if this one sells gold. Iron. Barrel. No gold though. Someone's buying iron. Iron from here though. Okay. Howdy. Howdy. That is worth seven grand. That helmet there is worth seven grand. Let's make sure I take that. It's worth seven grand if you sell it at the space station. Uh, I think it's only worth about three or something if you don't. If you sell it at like a, not even a big one. If you sell it at the normal place, like a town city thing. All right, that's that. So all packages have been gotten. Now we just got to drop off the last two. It is a nice ship, this. Request takeoff. What am I doing? <laughs> Turn the engines on. Turn the engines on. Close doors. Toy landing yet. We track landing gear. So let's see where we've got to drop off to now. So we're going to drop off one at Clio and drop one off at Microtech. So we'll go to Clio first and drop that one off. At I've gone and done it again, Anna. McGrath. I'm going back down, guys. I've got to go back down. In fact, yeah, I'm going back down. I forgot to put my stuff in again. I can't keep doing that. Around here should be enough. Well, that's cool, isn't it? I've never seen that before.
never seen that before. I know I'm, I know what's it called, but you are blocking an active flight bay. Please I think I can request it. Request landing. Contacting ATC. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Now is it going to tell me I'm trespassing? Please proceed to sign landing bay. I have done. Launch complete. So you lied to me. Oh, it's there. Warning. You are blocking an active flight bay. Please vacate the facility. There, I'm landed. Landing complete. Landing complete. Have a pleasant stay. <laughs> so I could land here. Uh -huh. It's not letting me do any of that stuff, though. Anyway, it's not why we're here, is it? <laughs> Can be floating away there. It's fine. As long as I can do this, they come. That helmet is worth a lot of money. Now we'll try again. It's got a clear. Drop off the package. Deploy landing gear. Deploying landing gear. Landing gear deployed. Open doors. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Inactive. So what I can do, I know I'm going back to the space station, so I'm going to pick up some med supplies here. I won't get a lot, but even if it's an extra thousand or something, it's better than nothing. Right, so 2801. That one there. 
the one that was running away earlier on. terminal should handle that. Well, my box delivery. I don't think it will. I think you're lying, mate. No rata dung. Right, so I'm gonna pick up some med supplies here. Cause I'll um, earn some money from that. Hello. Hello. Check the car so, terminal, that should sort you out. Nine grand, nine point eight grand for our med supplies. Nine point eight. And see what we're selling for later. And we go back to the space station to sell stuff. For the vehicle terminal. No, I'm not. I'm going to close that so that package is not Looty loot loot. Bit of hit and miss just recently with these boxes. Moonwalking. Doing a bit of moonwalking there, guys. Here you box. So we got in here shoes. We'll take that. That will take. That will take. That will take. Then we'll take. That will take. Cool. 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 So one box to deliver and then go and sell the gear. Even though I forgot two places um, to put it on, maybe more than two places, to actually put the gear on, but 
Is what it is. I'd say we probably had about five grand of stuff in those. Such a cool ship, this. Right, let's not forget this this stuff this time. Move it on. Turn ship on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems operational. Turn engines on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems operational. Close doors. Retract landing gear. Retracting landing gear. Landing gear raised. Right, so we've got to get back over to Microtech. Get that sun out my eyes. Here we go. That should now put us in line. Badly used any fuel. Last delivery coming up. Deploy landing gear. Deploying landing gear. Landing gear. 
open doors. Open doors. I left the engines on, it's a dangerous thing to do. Someone else doing deliveries here. A vulture. Done. So there we go, all deliveries done. And we should get 15 grand for that. There we are. Let's loot the box. So these are all somebody else's deliveries. So I don't take them. I don't touch them. Yeah, done. All right, so let's head to the space station and sell the gear we've got. Make sure we take the gear over. Close doors. Track landing gear. So now we're going to head over to the space station and sell this stuff that we've got. We've made our 15 grand and upped our rep. So we'll show you that now. So we've got to Delphi here, and you'll see it was by history UDM Locum Unified Distribution Management. So we go to Delphi and we look for Unified Distribution Management there. And you see we've got a little notch all there now, and we started pulling up our junior runner. Once we get to runner, we'll start doing, we'll be able to do bigger missions like in the bunkers and stuff. So I'm going to do a couple of these missions. I'm going to, once I've sold all the gear, I'm going to end the video, but I'm going to do a couple of more missions. I might do them live actually on a live feed. And um, yeah, so that's what I'll do. The reason I fell in love with the game to begin with. Is that An eclipse?
Retract. Uh, deploy landing gear. Deploy landing gear. Deploying landing gear. Request. Landing gear Request landing. Contact landing ATC. complete. Have a pleasant stay. Hello, and thank you for contacting EDL Landing Assist. Good job I've got an agile ship in it. Wheels down. Turn engines off. Turn ship off. Turn ship off. Starting pre-flight protocols. Off. Not on. All systems operational. There we are. So we've got med supplies to sell as well. Now, someone did suggest just leaving the stuff from the ship into the lot in the ship rather than putting it over to local. But the reason I put it over to local is because I'll end up forgetting it's in the ship and I just don't want to clog up the ship because you only have a certain capacity with your ship as well and you don't end up filling it up. So let's move all that over to the station and then that frees up that space and we've got them to sell as well. So something I want to check out here, guys, is in the last time I did the uh, video on small ship cargo, I mentioned that you get a different price for med supplies at the medical center. And someone commented and said um, that you get the same price at the, at, the hap, at the cargo center. So I want to just check that out because that maybe they've changed that now. So I just want to correct that if, it's, if I got it wrong. Welcome to the ASOP Vehicle Retrieval System. So I'm going to put med stuff. So this med thing here, I'm going to put that onto my personal armor. Go over there then. And go over here. That. Need to go over there. And I got these six here. So I'm not going to be able to take them. So let's split that to three. See if we can go over. Yeah. I've got these three here as well. Plus these three. So it's just doing a bit of organizing here, guys. I just saw. So they're all next to each other. Like these can all go on top of each other. I can sell all them 12 together. Keeps resetting it. I'll be able to sell all them 12 together. Can I put them on top of each other now? No. So the rat dungs as well, we'll see how much rat dungs we've got. 27, 40, 34. Got the cases there. That helmet there is going to be worth seven grand. 
So let's go down there. So like I said, I want to check the two places of selling. Because it used to be you got more here than you did at the other place. So if I was selling these, I'd get about 180 here, but only around 90 or something at the other place. So you get about 180 here per per one, and then you'd you wouldn't get you'd get set 90 at the other place. So there's a thousand for that. And the reason I put it into my armor is because for some reason the hospital now has its own inventory doesn't have a, a normal inventory. So let's go to the gallery first. I want to sell that med supply stuff. So we paid 9,800 for the, for the meds. So let's see what we get from here. So we made just short of two grand. Just short of two grand on the med supplies. So we've made three grand up to yet, plus the 15. So we're at 18 grand. We've been playing an hour and a half and we're at 18 grand. Not the massive um Okay, what's that then? That looks like maze. That's tree pollen, I think. That's tree pollen, I think that. I think he was realised he was supposed to put it in there. The vehicle terminal should handle that. No, it's not. Not gonna handle it. Okay, let's go and sell our claws over here first. While we're here, I might as well do that. Get rid of our beanie. Caught. I could probably sold them somewhere else. Ah. Boots. 81 for these. I'm going to save one of them, sell it downstairs if I can. 81. Shoes. I'm just going to sell it. So that's that. So 6.3k for that there. I'm not going to sell that bad part because it's only one. Oh. What's going on? Probably have used that, but it's fine. One for that, the pink ones, 19. We might have a few of them, so let's just check. Yeah, so we've got five of them. We might have a few of them as well. A lot. Seven of them. And that, we may have a few. Just a lot. We'll sell it for one dollar. 
one unit. So we're not selling that. So it's 6.3 up here. So it's probably the same downstairs. So off to the cargo centre. So, 6.3, so it is the same up here for that one. Clubs 130. Not going to sell any of that stuff. So these we're going to sell. I do this because there might be a couple to sell on each one. So if I, I'll just do it that way. So there we go. So uh, I was I was correct. The lifeguard medical attachment is 180 up at the pharmacy, and it's only 100 here. So definitely um, sell the, the lifeguard attachments and the white, the white med guns. Anything medical sell up at the the pharmacy itself. So I'll put them in my backpack in a minute and then sell them. I won't sell those, those other guns, I'll keep those. But those ones for one unit, I won't sell them. Might be a couple of those, so let's check, seven. So there we go. And the Orbit mining things, we might have a couple of them as well, 12. Cool. So I'm going to go and sell them, and then that's it, everything's sold. So, because it's probably like another grand on top, the extra that you're going to miss. If we're going to miss 80 per unit, and we've got 12, it's going to be 12 times 80. Close to a grand. So what I'm going to do is make sure I put them over into my jacket up here. So I want to get rid of that. Put that over here. Now can I? Yeah, there we are. Medical concerns got you worried? There's something more serious. Getting the right treatment has never been easier thanks to the advanced digital medical assistance available at every Kelto RX. So 180 here you see. It's where there are 100 downstairs. So let's hit sell and we'll sell six of those for 1,000. That's that. So that's that done. We've, we've been on it for about an hour and 40 minutes. Let's have a look at what we've got. We did start off with, let's just have a look at this. So we've currently got 5 million. 820,769. We started with. Have a look. 5,774,510. So 46,000 we made on that altogether. 15 of that was the run so we made about 30,000 on the, the cargo uh, on the thing is that we sold the cargo was two grand so we made yeah we made about 30,000 just on on loot alone yeah it's not the most profitable thing but it's it's one of those things when you get bored of doing cargo running all the time or mining all the time it's just something different going to all the different locations and see what's there scouting around you could even take it further and use 
um, SC Trade Tools or UEX and find out what cargoes, the places you're going to uh, buy and sell. Maybe you could pick up some cargoes on the way. Maybe you could take a slightly bigger ship like the Nomad and do more with the cargo on your way back. Um, but yeah, that's that. And we're gonna basically unlock our, in our dev, we're gonna, we're gonna unlock our, this unified, unified dis distribution. And we're gonna get up to this runner here. So that's, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do that on the live, probably. So that's the, the box missions and a five one. We made 50 grand. I know it's not a lot, but for some, someone that's got a small ship, there you go, you can make 50 grand like that. Um, it, it was easier, basically. I didn't spend no money out, apart from the cargo, I got the medical supplies, which was 10 grand. But if you haven't got that, it was only a two grand profit. The rest, all the money came from the looting. And there was probably about five grand, I think I said, in loot that I didn't put on my ship that I forgot about. So that's just, that's just lying there. And at some point that will come over to me. Um, or if I'm in them areas again, I'll pick it up at that point. Um, so that's that guys. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to take that point. So tickle that like button for us. Hit the bell and subscribe notification. Sorry that it's not, I've not had a lot of videos out lately. I've been, um, I, I took on uh, my nephew, uh, adopted him and it's been a whirlwind. And um, he was a one year old. And so basically I've been sorting out that and my house and my streaming as well as work and then trying to find a schedule around my work and my partner's work. And so that's why I've, I've sort of been uh, been away a, a little bit and not really been being able to do too much. But I want to get back onto the streaming and doing more videos and finding the time, it's just finding that schedule, that right schedule that fits for us now. And so, yeah, so we hope you like this video, guys, and um, look forward to getting back on the lives again, and we'll see you guys soon.